Hey everybody and welcome back to the ACP Culinary Center. I'm Chef Phil Monk and today I'd like to talk to you about the Convection Express combination oven from ACP. Uh, this oven features 1400 watts of microwave energy and that's fed straight from the, uh, from the top of the oven down to the food. It also has a temperature range from 200 degrees to 475 degrees, which makes it uh, more versatile when you're trying to do different kinds of foods. So it takes the heat of the oven and adds a microwave, which uh, combines it for speed cooking. So you can usually do foods about four times faster than you could in a traditional oven. Uh, the oven's also completely pre-programmable, so once you have something programmed into it, it's just touch and go from there, and it can hold a hundred items in the oven, so it has lots of room to expand on whatever items you're trying to do. I'll go ahead and cook a few items for you to just give you some idea of the versatility of the oven. The first item we're going to do for you is nachos. This is just a heaping uh, portion of nachos. It's on an uh, oven safe plate, so that can go straight into the uh, unit. So we go into the oven. It's already pre-programmed, number one, to cook. So all you have to do is press number one and it's away in cooking. And this item is going to use 100% of the microwave for a minute and 25 seconds to a cook time. Now you can vary all the different, uh, different elements of the oven. So you can lower and higher the temperature as needed. And you can also control the amount of microwave you're putting in. So if this item was more delicate and we didn't want as much microwave, we can uh, lessen the amount that we want in 10% increments, all the way down to zero or up to 100. So we'll go ahead and let this cook. All right, now that the food is done, just remove it from the oven. Make sure you use a hot pad because it is, the oven is hot. And there you go, you have browning on top, steam coming off it, it's hot, hot all the way through, and then go straight out to your table, ready to eat. So next item I want to do for you is a uh, quesadilla. Uh, this is already pre-made, but it's got chicken, cheese, uh, cilantro, and salsa in it. So this is actually going right on our grill plate in the oven, so you'll get a grilled look to this item. So that goes into the oven. Again, it's already pre-programmed. I know it's program number two, so all I have to do is walk up, press number two, and that's going to go for two minutes at 80% microwave. It's a little bit longer cook time, but it needs that time to get the grill marks uh, on the item. And then 80% is because it is a longer time. We don't need 100% microwave for the full time. Uh, this. This oven has an actual nice application for anywhere that you want to expand on your menu, but you don't have very much room in your kitchen. So it's like having a small oven that you can place almost anywhere in a, in a kitchen. So we'll go ahead and let that item cook. Okay, now that the oven is done, uh, we'll go ahead and take it out of the oven. So if you get some browning on top, the real feature is the grill marks that you get from having it on the accessory. So as you can see, it's steaming all the way through, it's hot, ready to go, just cut that up, take it out of your table, and you're ready to go. Uh, the next item we're going to do is shrimp. Now these are citrus marinated shrimp, so all we did is put a, uh, a nice easy marinade on it, and this probably got one portion, around eight ounces of shrimp. So we're on a metal sheet tray. Now even though there is microwave within this oven, you can still use metal because of the way the microwave is being fed into the cavity. So again, it's already pre-programmed, put it in the oven, Press number three, and we're off and cooking. Right. The buzzer goes off, so we know the item's done. Go ahead and take it out. Now, for this particular uh, item, it was a minute and a half at 100% microwave, and you can see the steam rolling off it. It's their baking color that cooked all the way through. It only took a minute and a half cook time. Uh, no, uh, the last item I want to do for you is just some potato wedges, which will show the browning of the oven. And I'll go ahead and do a manual cook on this so you can also see how it's programmed when we do it. So what you want to do is uh, have your settings in mind when you go to the oven. But all you do is put the product in the oven, shut the door, hit the, the book, which is programming, touch whichever uh, item you want it to uh, program. It's number four is empty, so we can go ahead and enter a time. So then you touch the clock, which is entering time. We'll say three minutes on this item. And then you touch the power level, and you can tell how much power you want. We want 90% microwave for those three minutes. Touch the book again, then that program is saved. So now uh, that the oven's item's in there, we'll crush number four, and our three minutes at 90% is off and cooking. 
Now this oven um, is nice because you can program the 100 items into it and then you can transfer uh, information from this oven to another oven using a card that you just download the information onto and then you take it to another oven, upload it, so both ovens will be exactly the same. So we'll go ahead and let this cook and we'll see what it looks like after three minutes. So the oven's done, go ahead and take the items out. As you can see, they're brown, golden, hot all the way through, steam coming off, and you're ready to go. Go ahead and plate these up for you. So there you go, a wide variety of items done in the, in the oven. We have raw foods, we have uh, foods that are browning, quesadilla, it's a full meal in a very short amount of time. All done in the Convection Express. Uh, if you have any further questions on the Convection Express, feel free to contact us at the Culinary Center. We're always open for questions. I'm, I'm Chef Phil Monk, and thanks for stopping by the Culinary Center.